feel like breaking down? Do you ever feel out of place? Like somehow you just don't belong and no one understands you. Do you ever want to run away? Do you lock yourself in your room with the radio on turned up so loud that no one hears you screaming? No, you don't know what it's like when nothing feels alright. You don't know what it's like. What's up, guys? What's up? This is uh, the normal time I roll to school at. It's uh. 12:20, early day for me, I guess. Yeah, this is where I go to school. I go to Crespi. Um, it's a good place to get an education. Good place to play football. Good place to the mascot. Yeah. Kevin, you're about to hit a tree. Just let you know. Um, I got a story I'm going to tell you. Uh, I'm going to tell it to the guy's uh, face because it's uh, pretty funny. I must say. Let's go. Let's follow this guy. This right here is Mr. Thornton, the biggest guy ever, but you can never hear him walk in a room. True story. He did that to me last week. I was sleeping. He got me. You're good man. Um, what else did I ever talk about? This one's very religious. <laughs> That's Mr. Connor. Uh, yeah. What's up, camera crew? I see you. I see you doing work. Let's go to the least room, least room used at Crespi. She hates it when I walk in. Chief Show X today. That's the library. She gave me that. I think that's uh, about it. Some what sucks. You know what? Go kill yourself. Hey, you know I'm done with this. Be done. Okay, listen, Sean. I have the perfect idea for you. Look, I know you've done the whole boy next door, boy gets girl kind of thing. Oh, it's really, really cute. You, you know, you get all the girls. I have a perfect idea for you. You haven't done this yet, okay? I know you have. Combining worlds that should never belong together. What do you think of this? Hi, Sean. How you, how you doing? Nice I'm good, Ron. How are you? Nice good, good, good. Now, I understand you've been going through some hardships a couple weeks. That ain't me, man. Hey. I'm straight. Okay, well, that's not what we all hear. Liars. You got it. I have haters. Everyone has haters. I'm, pr I'm pretty sure you have haters, man. Well, I probably do. Now, why are you trying to make a comeback? Why is the sky purple? That's a good one. Oh, repeat that. Why is the sky purple? <laughs> well, sir, uh, you're kind of an idiot. I'm not an idiot. You're, the sky is blue. It's purple. It's blue. You see, like, a uh, purple tree? That's a purple tree. No, Sean, look at the damn sky. The it's sky blue. Is, the sky is purple and the tree is purple. Do you not see this? It's a clear angle right there. Are you kidding? That is a clear angle of a purple tree. It's blue. There's a purple elephant over there. It's blue. Are you blind? There's a purple elephant over there. The sky is blue. Where do you get an elephant from? You're a towel, all right? You're a towel. I'm leaving. Catch me on MLL. Peace. All right. Well, that was a very interesting interview. I'm Ron Beasley. See you next week.